It was a sea of red and white and some rain jackets in Centennial Park as residents from Fort St. John and surrounding communities gathered to celebrate Canada Day. Afternoon radio host for 101.5 The Bear, Keir White, emceed the event that featured several live musical performances and entertainers. Canada Day is for everybody. It's not just for kids. It's not just for adults to see everybody out, everybody out here, no matter what their cultural background is, no matter their age, um, to have everybody out here um, experiencing the music, the activities, everybody together, and that's what Canada Day is all about. Leading up to the festivities in Centennial Park, residents crowded downtown streets, many under umbrellas, to take in the annual Canada Day Parade. The city says there was some concern about a possible thunderstorm storm warning leading up to the event, but decided to keep the festivities outdoors despite the rain. We just said, you know what, we don't get to do, get to do a lot of big, Canada Day is our big outdoor summer event, and it would have to be really bad weather for us to move it inside. We want people to be outside. We don't get to do this all the time, all year, so we said, let's do it. We made the call Thursday morning, and we just said, we're going to push through and have it outside, and nobody seems to be complaining, so... In fact, it was quite the opposite. As children played in bouncy castles and residents enjoyed all the live entertainment and food in Centennial Park, you could say the community embraced the rainy weather. It's obviously a very like family-oriented community and lots of small children and, and I love it. Like walking up and down there and seeing them wave, it's so like that's why we do what we do. That's why I work in recreation. I love to watch people having fun, um, all ages really. And, um, and now here with the inflatables and the carnival games, the face painting, like we have something for, for all the kids and even for the adults. We got the beer garden this year. So um, yeah, it's just been a really rewarding day and I'm so happy to see that people didn't stay at home because of the rain. The celebrations wrapped up with a fireworks show at Sereris Ball Diamonds. Brendan Miller, CJDC TV News, Fort St. John.